Today is every player's guy's favorite day of the year. This should honestly be a national holiday. It is the 2022 release day for the new player sleds. Guys, I am so, so hyped to see what they're putting out tonight at 7 p.m. There's a lot of speculation out there and there's a lot of things I wanna see and there's a lot of things that you guys wanna see. And obviously me being the big players guy I am, I've been doing a lot of digging and a lot of research, trying to find out what they're doing, what the color schemes are gonna be, what's gonna be new for players this year. And I think I found a few things that not a lot of you guys have seen and we are about to get into that right now. And this is the first one and oh my God, this color is absolutely insane. Like this color literally goes Goes crazy um it looks to be an indie of some sort like a vr1 launch edition matrix some sort of matrix trail sled but the white with the blue and the red accents oh my god like if this is for real like this is gonna be a hit like if they put this color on an rmk sold i'm buying it 110 percent absolute gorgeous color and it took me forever to find these pictures, like a bunch of digging through Facebook and forms. So I don't even know if these are like actual spy shots of the sleds or if these are like some custom painted matrix that people got this year. Um, I'm not too sure, but this looks like a color scheme that Polaris would do um, besides maybe like the handguards. I don't know if Polaris would do those handguards, but you know what though? The handguards look to have the Polaris logo on them, so I might be wrong. So this could actually be a 2022 Polaris. Here's the next one. This is very similar to my dad's sled. He has an 850 2019 SKS. He has the lime squeeze and the blue, but this is on a matrix. And um, I don't know how I feel about this one. Honestly, it looks a little awkward on the sled. I, I can't really put my finger on what I like or don't like about this, but it's just something doesn't seem right. Maybe it's just the way like the hood's black, but you got color going on everywhere else. I think that's what it is for me. Is I think the hood needs to be like lime or blue or something just to tie it in. The black really doesn't flow, but this is another viable option for what players would do because this is a color scheme players has done in the past. So it makes sense that this would be a new Polaris. So here's the next one. I truly believe that this color scheme is in the 2022 lineup just because it's a shot of it on the snow in the mountains. It looks like they're almost testing new sleds here because I think I see a Lynx in the corner. Yep, I do see a Lynx over there and I see an Articat and I see a Skidoo. So this looks like they were out testing or shooting some promotional video or some sort of review on the new sleds, almost like a snow gore magazine type thing. So I'm pretty confident that that is gonna be a color scheme and I like it, it's good looking. It's a, it's a really nice looking sled actually. The color scheme, it flows well. I like the white, I like the red, I like the blue. Going back to that first picture I showed you guys of the all white one with the red and blue accents, I made a comment about the handguards saying I don't think this thing players would do. But if you look closer at this picture, at the handguards on this sled, they are the identical handguards, just a different color to that first one. So that first sled I showed you guys could quite possibly be an actual color scheme. Because one thing I do feel is Polaris does sometimes lack color scheme. Like when they put the Matrix out for 2021, I feel like the color scheme kind of sucked. It was just nothing like too appealing to me. Now this is what I'm most excited about and hoping Polaris adds to the lineup is bring the Matrix chassis to the RMK lineup. Now this is not an actual Matrix RMK. This is someone's custom build. What it looks like they did is they took a Matrix Switchback Assault 146, put an RMK 155 skid on it, and put the RMK front end on it. So this is pretty much like a mock-up Matrix RMK if they were to make it. And God damn, does it look amazing. Um, it's, it's gorgeous. Like if they really do do this tonight when they release their sleds, it's game over. This sled is getting traded in, sold, whatever. I'm getting rid of it, and I will be ordering one of these because this looks incredible. Before I talk about a couple things I want Polaris to do this year, and I'm hoping they do, let me know in the comments below what you want to see from Polaris. So the first thing I want to see is I want to see the Matrix chassis on the RMK. That's pretty much a given. Like I'm not ordering a new sled unless they put the Matrix chassis on the RMK. Next thing I want to see is a Matrix RMK Chaos. Like if they come out with a Matrix RMK Chaos, it's game over. Like it's done deal. Like this sled's gone and I will have one of those in the fall. The thing I want to see, even though it wouldn't really benefit me, but it'd be really cool to see because I feel like Polaris is behind times with this, is a factory turbo sled. Now the Skidoo's been doing that with the Summit and now the free ride this year. I think it's time Polaris finally does a factory turbo sled. And I know like the turbo's not gonna help where I live, but when you go out west or like in higher elevations, it helps you keep the power of the sled. So I really hope Polaris pulls through with that. I think that would kind of catch them up to Skidoo in that way. I think Polaris are ahead of Skidoo in a lot of things, but there are a couple things that Skidoo is ahead of, like the factory turbo sled and also the shot electric start is an awesome system. And I wish Polaris did something like that for these sleds because their electric start, it's just, it seems outdated, it, it's just heavy, and like I said, it seems outdated. So hopefully they do something similar to SHOT, that'd be really awesome. Another thing I hope Polaris does is they bring the 7S display to the mountain lineup, that would be pretty sweet. Big question, will I be snow checking? 
Like I said, if they come out with a Matrix, RMK, Chaos, it's game over. I will be snow checking for sure. So this was basically all the information I have for you guys. We will see what players actually ends up doing tonight at 7 p.m. And I am super stoked. I think I'm going to go ahead and film my live reaction going through their website with all the new sleds for you guys. And that will be up tomorrow. Like I mentioned before, let me know in the comments below what you want to see from players this year. If you guys like today's video, smash a huge thumbs up on today's video. If you guys are new here or you've been watching for a while and you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I'll catch you guys next video. Peace out. Hey. Foot on the gas, foot on the gas, living too fast, living too woke. It's not where you been, nah, nah. Boy, where you at? Hey. Don't tell me relax, nah. I keep it a stack.